When I think of Nala, the first word that comes to mind is love, easily, just like that. Because uh, I, the love I feel for my friends here is just as strong as the love I feel for my family because the people here are my family and the connection is that strong. When I think of Nala, I think of um, love and family. Home. Why? Uh, because it's, it's um, you, just, you just feel so connected to it. It's just, it's, it's such a nice place to be. Like, there's, there's no other way for me to describe it. When I think of Nala, the first word that comes to mind is community. Um, I think Nala is like the truest form of what a community is. Just, you have a family here no matter who you are. And so, you always feel at home in your community. I think everybody at Makhane, um comes for not the same reasons, but similar reasons, um, and they come to be part of a community that is inclusive, just that is the goal of this community, and so I think when everybody has that same mindset, it just becomes a really beautiful and accepting environment. So the second I come here, I feel at home because everyone is willing to take you in and um, accept you for yourself. I know like kids are going to be watching this and like, oh yeah, they have to do work, but really it's it's really fun. Like you, it's not like work. It's more, it's just hanging out, you know, cleaning some things, having fun. It's like, yeah, we, we do our own dishes, we do our own pots, we, we clean up the buildings and we do everything. We don't have a staff here that takes care of the behind the scenes stuff. That's all us. Um, we set the table for breakfast and then after that we cut, um, we cut the vegetables for the salad. It's, uh, um, it's really fun getting to contribute to all the meals. This really provides a lens of Judaism through social justice, which is like not really explored in like um, a classroom setting, and um, it's a, it's a lot more of a conversation and discovery rather than just like facts and dates. Yeah. Um, and I think that's really um, interesting because you get to hear other people's opinions that you usually wouldn't be able to hear. Uh, you can choose if you want to fast on Tisha B'Av, you can choose if you want to say certain prayers. No one's making you do anything and no one's saying you can't do anything. Yeah, my mom, when I was telling my parents about what we do at Machaneh for Shabbat, my parents were so excited because I'm finally excited about celebrating Shabbat. Um, and there's all these traditions that we have, like Israeli dancing, we could, which I know is awesome. It's awesome. <laughs> Um, and the special dinners we have and getting dressed up and being in nature for a lot of it, it makes it a really special time. I like never really felt like I could connect to Shabbat until I came to Machana because um, I guess like it's like the biggest sense of community I felt here anywhere really. We all we all like have a lot of special rituals that we do together. When we go down to the lake, it's really beautiful and we also um, get to like hear stories and just spend time together as a whole camp. Well, basically, I want to be exactly like my mother came when I grow up because, like, they I think they're great role models and they they help me a lot, especially since the, my first year. You know, like getting through homesickness and stuff like that. So I really love to be like them when I grow up. Most camps like have like one reunion a year and like it's like a huge event, but like. Ken's like really provide like like twice a month um, like you get to see your camp friends and like it's so special and like other camps don't really get that like close knit experience during the year and like I really think that like because of the Ken your relationships with your age group doesn't matter. School is stressful and there's a lot of things going on and there's a lot of like drama and like anxiety around school and then like you but then you can see your camp friends and you can see all the people who make you really happy and it's it's really wonderful to, for kids to just like hop on the subway if they live in New York City to just hop on the subway go down and, and see their friends I've just I've learned so much about socialism and feminism so many other topics um, that have helped me kind of find what I'm passionate about it's more than a physical place, it's more than a camp, it's really a family here.
think because of Machana, I am much more comfortable with myself and who I am. Just walk beside me and be my friend. Together we will walk in peace. <laughs> feel like you'll come back to Nala for a long time? I hope so.